Hi guys, welcome back to the video where we'll be discussing on how to make algo trades. And in today we will uh, today video will be discussing on how to extract data from Yahoo and then convert it into a CSV file or an Excel file for further data analysis. So we'll move on and start writing in an editor which I'm using is Atom. Basically, I'm writing a Python code here. So people need to understand Python programming. Please look into the description videos and we can, uh, you know, carry on this Python tutorials later, maybe, but uh, today's uh, video is for people who understand Python programming and who have knowledge of, uh, you know, basic computer language. So I'm just trying to locate where I'm going to create this file. So I'll be creating it under YT. So I've created a new file and I'll first save it as a Python file so that It doesn't get mixed up with other file names. Yeah, so I have saved the file as import.py and we'll look on how to extract data from Yahoo. So df is the data frame that I'm creating a variable and I will use Panda data reader to fetch the data from online. Then I'll use a function from Yahoo Finance get underscore data underscore Yahoo. So this is a predefined program and we can use this instead of creating our own. Then we will insert the stock symbol name. So here I'm typing reliance dot NS. So these are the symbols format for uh, fetching data in Yahoo Finance from Yahoo and then I'll write a start date and an end date. So this is the function that will fetch us the data and to create this program we will need to import few libraries. So I'll be importing pandas. I'll be Importing Pandas data reader. And I'll be importing Yahoo Finance. Also, since I'm using start and end date, uh, I'll be using date time function. So I'll import these dependencies also. So these are nothing but libraries already created uh, by Python community. So it helps us to make uh, programs easier. Instead of writing all the codes, we can do it in two, three code lines. So I think the dependencies have been uh, taken all the dependencies yeah so uh, again i'll check pdr already there for pandas data reader data get underscore data yahoo for fetching from yahoo finance and date time for start and end date so now we need to define our start and end date so start will be dt dot date time you can 
type in any date format. So this is first is year, second is month, and third is date. Similarly for end date we will put 2020 today's august and we'll put yesterday's date 10. so what will happen is this function will extract the reliance data from 1st jan 2015 to 10th of august 2020 and present us with all the details such as open, high, low, closed data. So, hence to check the function we have written correctly, we will write print dot print bracket df dot head, and then we will check it in command prompt. So, you write these uh, codes in editor save these files in your editor directory and then you want to fetch this using your command prompt so we will now share the screen for command prompt so i think you guys can see is command prompt and there i will be writing the file directory from where I want to fetch this file. So I have stored this file in desktop five for e folder, and that's what I will be writing here. So instead of font, I'll type import dot py. So it should be giving me a data now after entering so it'll take some time to fetch the data because it's five years data so it'll take some time so this data extraction is uh, normally so it has fetched the data and it is showing high low volume adject, uh, adjust, this is uh, adjusted close values so we can see the data fetched from uh, this function this program and then we can save this file into an excel or a csv format so i'll again go back to my editor screen and give the function for saving it So this function will save in the path file. So I have to define path file again. So whichever uh, directory you want the file to be saved, it will save in that uh, in that location. So I'll put C drive double hash users double hash forward slash and the file name so i'll give this nift uh, reliance and i'll put dot csv as a format so this uh, function will save the file in csv format and put this in this location c drive users so let's execute this and again, I'll change my screen to command prompt and we will execute this file again. So this time it should be saving the data in my directory. So 
I'll go to my folder. And desktop five for e yt. So it has saved the Reliance file in my directory in my location. And once I open it, I'll again share this file. So this is the file that got saved, and you can see all the values here. The column names date high low open close volume and adjusted close so from this data we can see a lot many stuff and we will try to dissect this data into different so you know parameters and try to look the information presented in a much more uh, synthesized manner so i hope you like this uh, video so please uh, you know Give a thumbs up if you have learned something new and if you want to know something else, want to extract some other information from NSE website or from any other uh, API web connection that you are interested on, please contact and I would like to help you out. And as I am trying to showcase all the information with respect to programming. I would like to also test myself in different uh, you know, formats. So uh, in next video, we'll be looking into how to extract after the data collection, how to you know, uh, manipulate the data in Python and using data frames pandas. So keep watching the channel or further interesting videos. Thank you.